Discipline and Trials of Ramu Part 6. All right, you got to do it in 130 uh, terms, five battles. So I'm bringing a uh, OK team. Let's see, who should I use? This guy looks good. He's got Brotherhood. So I'm doing auto right now. Does the computer do it faster than I can? There you go. I like skeletons, they're easy to kill. Oops. This guy. Go sleep, alright? I gotta watch out for his breaks, so. Unfortunately, I cannot kill him too fast. No, I need to break him. There you go. Go sleep. Now I'm gonna attack you. What? Only half? All right, he's got a lot of hit points still. They're making this just difficult because they just add a lot of hit points to the monster. It doesn't make them stronger. It just it's kind of a easy way, I mean, cheap way to make the levels more difficult than it should be. What? Still no? Oh shit, I'm gonna be broken. I thought I was gonna be able to. Oh, thank god, did not get broken. Good. No, he got broken. So it's time to kill this guy. It took a while. I don't like these uh, avoiding broken uh, quests or missions. It just, it, I think it's a cheap game design. It just slows the game down for no reason at all. I wish they'd just get rid of it. Because you always cannot go full out, all out, if you're worried about getting broken. I don't like that. So anyway, that's just my little gripe. Still like this game very much. All right. Go sit down, boy. Again, this guy has a lot of hit points. I was talking to my Ida. I mean, it's my uh, shadow can. Uh, do HP attack. A unit attack HP. A Yida. Yeah, actually I could. Because Yuna has something good. It has, she has this, um, Isuna can raise the uh, brave for everybody.
Let's just keep dragging on. Because I'm trying to avoid getting broken. Fuck. That sucks. They just cheated. I hate that. Wow, that's a lot of damage. Son of a gun. Die. All right, Kraken, level 60. Okay, he's broken. Waterga. Wow, it does more damage than before. Okay, broken again. HP attack. Because he's targeting my Yida. Oh, no, it's targeting my Yuna. Well, since I got broken already, I don't care anymore. Whoa, that's 4,000. That's a lot. Ooh, that's a lot of water cannon. His brave is going up really fast. Ooh. Good thing my Yuna has a lot of hit points. Good. I'm trying to get the um, hit points down below half before I start um, attacking big time. Wow, that's a lot of uh, brave. Got to bring it down. Let's get the uh, uh, Tidus, and then let's trigger the uh, Shiva. I'm triggering a little bit faster than I want, but the the friend Tidus can do a lot of damage. So. Snap punch. Nice. 8500. Slash combo. 10,000. Alright, he's in the red now. Okay, so back to my shadow. Good, he's got broken. Probably need to start 
going a little faster before he goes crazy. All right. Okay, time to kill him. Okay, so it wasn't too difficult either. But what really uh, disappointed me was that uh, cheating um, that happened in the last fight when I got broken. It's really, really hard to do this no break mission. Getting a lot of coins. Level round move to 15. Okay. So, okay. So, this is how you do the uh, fight. I uh, just got to watch out for the uh, breaks. Other than that, it's not too difficult to finish the fight. Okay. As you can see, my party is not even maxed out. Shadow and Yida both just level 44 with crystals 35. Okay. So, if you like my video, please subscribe. Until next time, see ya.